Sabrina Silva with Katie Marimba here in Katy, Texas, and I help kids discover their musicianship through using diatonic marimbas. Diatonic marimbas are super, super easy to play, which makes them super fun to learn, and it helps us get past the learning part and go right into making music as a group. In this video, I'm gonna show you just how easy that is. We are going to play a well-known song that's always sung or played this time of year. It's, always, it's a way of bringing in the new year. It's a song called Auld Lang Syne. Some historians called the song that nobody knows because everybody knows the tune to this song, but not necessarily the words. The words were actually written by a Scotsman named Robert Burns back in 1788 and has been played every New Year's Eve here in the Americas since 1939. This song is a way of saying a sweet goodbye to this past year and then looking forward to the new year ahead. Teachers, I made this with you in mind for your classroom. You can play it with marimbas, obviously, but you can also play it with other bard instruments. You can play it with ukuleles. You can even play it with boom whackers if you wish. If you have any virtual students, you actually have, I found two websites uh, doing a quick search and I'll include those below. They're, they're pretty good. They, to me, they seem pretty good instruments, in, virtual instruments to play online if kids do not have access to instruments at home. You can use this for note identification for your little ones. You can also use this to practice rhythm patterns. Kids come up with their own rhythm. You can also use this for your older elementary or junior high for uh, teaching chord progression or, or just basic chords, the one, four, and five chord. We're just gonna be using C, F, and G. So grab your mallets, get to your instruments, and come along, play along. Thank you. 